2 raised to the power 5x minus 5 is equal to 5 raised to the power 2x minus 2. We have to find the value of x. So 2 raised to the power 5x minus 5, we can rewrite it using the identity a raised to the power m upon a raised to the power n is equal to a raised to the power m minus n. So if we have a raised to the power m minus n, we can write it as a raised to the power m upon a raised to the power n. So this we can write it as 2 raised to the power 5x upon 2 raised to the power 5 and this side also we can write 5 raised to the power 2x upon 5 raised to the power 2. Now let's send variables to one side. So this will be 2 raised to the power 5x upon 5 raised to the power 2x is equal to 2 raised to the power 5 upon 5 raised to the power 2, we send this to left hand side. It was in denominator, so it became numerator. Now, again, if a raised to the power m times n, then this we can write it as a raised to the power m whole raised to the power n. So, this we can write it as 2 raised to the power 5 whole raised to the power x upon 5 raised to the power 2 whole raised to the power x is equal to 2 raised to the power 5 is 32 and 5 raised to the power 2 is 25. Again, there is an identity if a raised to the power m upon b raised to the power m, then this we can write it as a upon b whole raised to the power m. So, we can write it as 32 upon 25 whole raised to the power x is equal to 32 upon 25. Now, both the bases are same. And we know if a raised to the power m is equal to a raised to the power m and a is not equal to 0 or 1, then m is equal to n. So, here if the exponent is 1, that means x is equal to 1. So, this is our answer. We can verify the answer. 5 x value of 1 is 1, then 5 times 1 is 5. 5 minus 5 is 0. This will be 2 raised to the power 0. And when a number is raised to the power of 0, then the value is 1. So, this side we have 1. Here also if value is 1, then this is 2 minus 2, 5 raised to the power 0, value is 1. LHS is equal to RHS. Like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.